that dream again. Well, I guess I should get up anyway. At 2 a.m.? No. You should just go back to bed. Oh, here we go. Oh. You can't play it. Never mind. Dang it. Won't be needing any of that today. No signal. They don't make them like they used to. What is that? Oh, that's our phone. Okay. Oh. Uh, check notifications. One missed call. Oh, it looks like Melissa called me. I guess I should call her back. Um. <clears throat> hey, Jane. It's been a while. Yeah, it has. I hope you've been all right. Yeah, I've been great, actually. Just busy. How about you? Doing all right. Not dead. That's good to hear. I was beginning to wonder. Can't get rid of me that easily. Hey. I'm going to be back in town soon. We should hang out. Really? Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah, Jack actually had an idea where we could go on a little camping trip this weekend. Like old times. Would you be interested? <laughs> yeah, that could be fun. Great, I'm so excited. I think James is coming too. Really? What's the occasion? It's a secret. Oh, come on. Nope, you'll have to wait. Fine, fine. Somewhere in Ohio. <laughs> We're being stalked. Well, we're here. This is the campsite? Yeah, nice, isn't it? I don't know. What do you think? I like it. Yeah, it's cool, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it'll grow on me. At least we can have a fire. We used to hang out near here forever ago. I guess you guys didn't come along. Well, we should get things set up before it gets dark. 6 p.m. Chapter 1. Reunion. Hey, sorry if this didn't meet your expectations. I guess I probably should have chose the location. Oh no, it's fine. I'm just glad to see everyone again. Yeah, me too. It'll be fun to hang out once we get everything set up. So, what do you think of the place? It's cool, I guess. A bit eerie, though, isn't it? Haha, <laughs> yeah, but uh, that's part of the fun. I guess. Hey, don't worry. If anything comes out to get us tonight, I've got this baby with me. Thanks, Jack. That makes me feel a bit better. You know you can always count on me. Oh. Hey, I'm glad you ended up coming. Well, Melissa wouldn't really take no for an answer. But yeah, me too. It's nice to see you. Yeah, you too. Do you need any help with anything? It looks like we forgot to buy firewood on the way here. Melissa won't be too happy about that. Yeah. There might still be some firewood left over inside a shack that's near here. Do you think you could go grab it? Sure. How do I get there? Oh, it's not too far. Just follow the right path and you'll find it. All right. I'll see what I can do. Cool. 
It's going to get dark soon, though, so you should take this. Mm. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Try not to get lost. Fuck. Okay, well, I guess I don't need it right now. D equip. <laughs> Just follow the right path and don't get lost. Shit. A trash panda! Oh, shit. Oh, shit! Oh, thought I was gonna attack. Raccoon noises. Oh, hey, little guy. It seems friendly. I guess it's used to people giving it food out here. Maybe I could find something to give it back at the camp. Uh, okay. Hold on, little trash panda. What do we got? <laughs> no hot dogs tonight. <laughs> Wait, what is that guy doing? Wait, did I go the wrong way? Wait, what? Oh, both paths end up at the same place. Oh, wait. Is that my trash panda? I did go the wrong way. Wait. What? Well, I'm out of stamina. <laughs> Is that the shack? Wait. I know that's an outhouse, but what's that? Because that's definitely not a shack. Hey, yo, look what I got you. Happy raccoon noises. Enjoy it, buddy. Okay, we're going to... I guess we'll just go this way. And check out the uh, outhouse here. And then make our way up to the not-so-shack shack. It's said they stalk the woods at night. Forever starving. Forever in pain. Aching to fill their empty stomachs. To feast on meat and organs. And once you hear their scratches echoing through the trees, it's already too late. Um, yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know why that crow scared me. Oh, here's a little shack. Maybe that's a rock. That must be a rock. Oh, no. Hello. Fear the moon. He's watching you. Who? E. Uh, campfire sign B. <laughs> Accidentally locked the shed on my way out. Whoops. I think the key should be somewhere in that abandoned vehicle on the cliff. Also, I think something might have died in there. The place reeks. Okay, so we've got to go get the key. There's nothing in there. The key is in a car. Oh, well, okay. So that one's the one that needs the key. All right, let's go get the key. In the abandoned car, up on a cliff. Hello? You never know. You can never be too safe with those trash cans. Wait. Do we go that way? No. All right. How do we get up to the cliff side? Abandoned car on a cliff. I've got a lantern and I'm not afraid to use it. Here's the car. Oh my god, it's a huge house. Big old farmhouse. Um, <gasps> creepy, isn't it? Oh, James, you scared me. Oh, sorry. 
What were you saying? The house. You can see it from here. Sure can. Oh yeah, I, I guess it's pretty creepy. Anyways, it's getting dark soon. Be sure not to get lost out here. Okay. I mean, you could just stay with me. You know, like... Shack key. Yes. Screwdriver. I guess not. Okay. Back to the shack. This way? Yeah. Shack key. What the hell? <clears throat> we got the firewood. It's gotten pretty dark. I should head back. Why is there a dead bird in here? What was that? Nothing. Wait. Oh! Uh oh. We gotta go. We gotta go. Wait, what? Place with logs next to the fireplace. If we make it back, that is. Uh oh. Guys, um. I'm back. Hey, are you okay? You look like you saw a ghost. I heard something weird in the woods. Oh, what did it sound like? I don't know, like a wolf or something. Huh, that's strange. Wolves haven't been anywhere near this area in like 200 years or something. Are you sure it wasn't a bobcat? Their scream sounds like a person dying. <sighs> Maybe it was the wolf man. Come on now, Jack. Don't be ridiculous. What? He could be real. You know the stories, too. Yeah, I do, and it's made up. What's the wolf man? Just a bit of an urban legend around here. I swear I saw him in the woods one time, after a party. And how many drinks did you have that night? Uh, I don't know. A few? Uh-huh. I really did see something, though. He was big and tall with bright eyes. Is that why you chose this place, Jack? Uh, maybe. I can't believe you. I'm sure it was probably nothing. Just freaked me out a bit is all. Yeah, even if a wolf did find its way around here, we're probably fine. Just stay near the camp. Can we get this fire started now? It's getting cold out here. Yeah, I'm ready to relax. Fine, fine. I'll get it started. PM. Jane, what are you looking at? Huh? Oh, sorry. It's, it's just that it's a full moon out tonight. So it is. Sure is pretty, huh? Yeah. Well, when you're done admiring it, come get your food. It's getting cold. Okay, cool. Oh, I need my bowl. Got it. I literally... 
Got it. I should sit down before I eat. Of course. Delicious. Gross slurp noises. <laughs> So good. Oh no. Panda's back. Trash Panda. Can't. Can't get up. I'm relaxing. It's so nice to see you guys again. Yeah, I'm glad I ended up coming. It's been a while, hasn't it? Since we were all together. Yeah, like almost a year now. You were right. The sky looks nice out there. Yeah, it's perfect. Nice to get away from all the light pollution. So, do you guys want to hear the legend of the Wolfman? Oh, great. This again. Hey, I know I can be obsessed with cryptid stuff sometimes, but this one's really creepy. Okay, sure. What is the Wolfman? Okay, so... It's an urban legend out here about um about a little <laughs> Okay, so it's an urban legend out. Okay, so it's an urban legend out here about the man that used his own property. About a man who used this property. He disappeared a long time ago, and there are stories that he's never actually left and instead turned into a wolf band that lurks the woods, attacking and eating animals and even humans. That sounds silly. It actually gets more twisted than that. He had a sort of animal sanctuary out here with lots of dogs he would take in and take care of, and he lived completely alone, aside from the animals. So when he disappeared, no one knew he was gone for a long time. When someone finally came out to check on him, they found something truly terrible inside the house. All the animals had starved to death, locked inside rooms and cages, scratches and blood all over the walls and doors. Oh my god, that's awful! Yeah, and that's not even the worst part. They say some of the animals had even started eating each other. Some say it was the owner himself that ate them, after he turned into the wolf man. But really, it's just stories told to try to keep kids from coming out here and underage drinking. Plus, with all the parties that used to happen out here, stories were bound to be made up from things people thought they saw or heard. There's even been a few missing persons out here. Yeah, that's really why people don't come out here anymore. Cops really started cracking down on the place after that. So why are we out here? For old time's sake. Plus all that danger makes it more exciting. You wouldn't want to hang out at any old campground, would you? It's okay. The most dangerous thing out here is deer and bobcats. Oh, and uh, Jack here. Dangerously handsome, maybe. Ha ha ha. Get it. I think our raccoon's gonna die. Uh, guys. 10 p.m. It's been nice catching up, but I think I'm gonna head to sleep. Yeah, same. Today has me beat. Wait, before you guys go, Jack and I have something to tell you. Oh, right. Oh, what is it? Well, I guess I'll just say it. <laughs> We're getting married. Oh, cool. Yep, finally decided to tie the knot. Wow, I'm happy for you guys. Thank you. And of course, I'm hoping you'll be my best man, bro. Uh, yeah, for sure, man. And I want you there too, Jane. Just like we talked about as kids. Sure, wouldn't miss it.
Uh, good night. Cool. You guys go ahead. Jack and I are going to hang out a little longer, I think. Um, okay. Let's go, James. They went to the shack at 12 a.m. Oh no. The fire is burnt out. Um, did I just hear a scream? It sounded like it came from that old shack. I should make sure everyone's okay. Or not? Do I have my... No, I gotta pick this one up. All right, here we go. Go to the shack. Going, going, going. I wonder if I could have grabbed the bat. I need to get my stamina back up. Um, hello? Guys, are you in here? What the? Got it. Jane? What happened here? I don't know. Me and Jack... I don't know. Me and Jack were just out here messing around and something attacked us. It all happened so fast. I, I couldn't really tell what was happening, but I think... I think Jack is hurt, like, really hurt. But this thing was so big and fast, it just picked him up and took him away like it was nothing. I think we have to get out of here. I don't know if we can help him. At least not on our own. Okay. Okay, we, sh we should get help. Yes, we need to get to the van. But Jack had the keys, and I think he dropped them in here somewhere. We have to find them. Oh, shit. Found a hiding spot. Mm. Keys, 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 keys. Are you guys in here at all? Oh, I can't even go in here. What the heck? Hold on. Oh. There they are. We got the keys. Let's go. How come I can't go back in there? Okay. Well. Let's go. Hey, I found the van keys. Let's get out of here. Thank God. Okay, let's go. Oh, shit. Just kidding. Jack! Is that you? Are you alive? <laughs> Hiding. <gasps> We're going, we're going, we're going, we're going now, 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 we're going now. I have to get out of here. No shit. Let's go. Stamina, 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 stamina. All right. We made it to the van. Oh, shit. Oh no! 